Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. In this video, we are going to demonstrate or simulate the top ten projects of IC seven forty one. IC seven forty one of IC seven forty one is very versatile and the most common and the most famous operation amplifier. So it has many application. This IC was introduced by Fairchild Company and in nineteen sixty eight. This IC has twenty resistors, twenty transistors, and eleven resistors, and one capacitor have been used in it. As the you are seeing in the diagram, this one is the symbol of the fusion amplifier. Current is flowing from outwards to the input, from input to the outputs. There are two inputs: one is inverting input, other is non-inverting input. Uh, Forty hertz is the oscillator frequency. 40 hertz is the input frequency. This frequency in this simulation it has been used as an inverting amplifier. As an inverting amplifier, it has been used. It 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 has to amplify the input. For example, from 5 volt to 15 volt, it is amplifying, increasing the input, as well as inverting the input. When the inputs is in positive up cycle output will be negative when the input is negative output will be positive so it is inverting the input as well as amplifying the input which has many application and uh, making a projects the second application of the principal amplifier it is in use as integrator it integrates the inputs two different input signal have been used 80 hertz and 40 hertz this ac has integrating adding this board both inputs and both inputs are for say one volt inputs are and output put we are getting 10 volts there is a out eight point five point eight microfarad between output and input so it is a, is a using ac 741 is an integrator the third application is this ac is used as a differentiator it differentiates the inputs for example when the input signal is a in a triangular shape, the output will be rectangular in the square wave shape because it is differentiating it. In some point, when voltage increasing, it will be positive value. When the uh, output input is decreasing, the differentiating will be negative value. and the peak value, it will be remain zero. So it has been used as a differentiator. As you can see, current is flowing outwards and inputs. The fourth application of the formation amplifier is that it is used as schematic trigger. And the inputs, we have two 1 kilohertz and 40, 40 hertz signals, which has been provided to inverting input. And the positive input uh, of the formation amplifier uh, has been configured uh, with three resistors. And in such a way, when the it, their threshold voltage is 5.48 uh, voltage. When the input voltage increases by 5.4 volt, or the output will be 1. Uh, otherwise, if the input voltage decreases from 5.48 volt voltage, the output will be mm, 0. So it is used in a switches to avoid oscillation in the output. And the fifth application of the provisional amplifier that it has been used as a in, in current to voltage converter and the input we are going, giving the current and the output we are getting the voltage for example uh, when the input current is zero output voltage is zero when the input current is one ampere milliampere output uh, voltage is one volt when the input input current is uh, two milliampere output is two volt when the input voltage current is three milliampere output is three volt so it is uh, using as a current voltage converter which may, which is used in different sensors this was the fifth application, the sixth application. And the seventh, uh, the sixth application of the operational amplifier, it is used as a, a voltage regulator. It regulates the our voltage. Uh, for example, we have a 12 volt stabilizer, stable voltage, and the input current is uh, uh, 1.9 ampere. So when, when we change the load current, uh, is you no know, the load current is 10 milliampere, voltage is again 12 volt. When the in output the load current is in increases uh, to 100 milliampere, uh, voltage is 12 volt, and when it increases to 1.9 ampere, 
the of the load when the load current is 1.9 ampere the voltage remain 12 volt in which uh, zener diode has been used zener diode 10 kilo ohm resistor operation amplifier and two pressure divider has been used and a signal waves as you can see in the graph the voltage remain the 12 volt as you can see in the graph and the current when increases or decreases but voltage remain constant voltage is 12 volt so it is a uh, as using is a current is a load uh, a voltage regulator so in seventh application auto prevention amplifier it has been used as a relaxation oscillator it is used as a relaxation oscillators uh, and input or both inputs are grounded and the inverting input is grounded by a capacitor and non inverting has been uh, uh, grounded by 100 kilo ohm so the we are uh, getting a 16 hertz frequency when you increase this frequency uh, resistance to 100 kilo ohm the frequency will increase as you can see no frequency has been increased uh, from 16 hertz to 45 hertz it has been used as a relaxation oscillator and the eight application of the oscillator amplifier it is used as a triangle wave generator triangle wave generator two pressure amplifier has been used okay one capacitor and three resistors have been used so we're getting a, a triangular wave generator and the eight uh, the ninth application of the oscillator uh, uh, ninth application of the ic741 is the uh, sine wave generator we can generate the sine waves which are used in the ups system for a sequence generator as you can see different capacitors have been used resistors both are grounded and we are getting the uh, 79 hertz frequency of the 15 volt ac current it means we are getting we are converting dc to ac converter we are converting the dc current into the ac current so this is used in the uh, ups system for um, promoting the battery voltage of 12 volt what is DC current and to 220 volt of AC current and the last application of the 10th application of the IC741 is the uh, it is used as a sawtooth wave generator it is a sawtooth wave generator and this is the same like a previous one but uh, here we are using the um, diodes And the awards have been used. Uh, this can be used as a two tube generator. And there are uh, many other applications of the IC C124 IC, which is very versatile ICs. And we can this can also be used as a comparator. This IC can be used as a comparator to compare both inputs or output voltage. For example, here we have to use IC pressure repair as a you can use as a inverting repair, summing repair. We can use as a comparator as a feedback. is a differentiator is in differentiator we can also use for example when the inputs are uh, positive, this is 3 volt otherwise 5 4 volt so output is 15 volt when the this inverting input is non inverting input when the input will be, uh, non inverting becomes greater than 4 volt inverting is become greater than 4 volt we are getting minus 15 volt when it becomes less than 4 volt output is 15 volt it is used as a comparator which can be used as a dark sensors uh, and uh, temperature sensors and uh, as a plant watering systems uh, this can use has many application in daily life using the uh, ICC 141 IC so thank you for watching our video